Huh? Come on, Camira all day long. Like I'm north south on somebody, I'm gonna get a Camira. Um, good. Yeah. So I'm north south, or I'm like moving around north south. Anytime his arm is out like this, it's going. So just pick that arm that you want to go. If he swims this arm in, you go back the other way, and eventually you're gonna get an arm somewhere. Once you get the arm. Yeah, paper cutter, but just to go a little bit more, like if I'm north south on him and I stay here, you're right, there's not much. So so a lot of times I'll move around to start to get him to move around. Oh, look at that, it opens up. But here, like what's your moment? Whatever he's doing. So he's doing this. Oh, okay, cool. Look at that. I, I didn't stay north south because I didn't have anything. But now I come down here, he's gonna have to make some adjustments. Oh, I just swam that arm in. Now I'm going back up. I'm taking that camera again. So if you go back and forth around the, around the north-south, from like cross-side, north-south, cross-side, north-south, they're gonna have to move their arms. And you can get ahead of their arms, and you can get one of them trapped. That, that's like a, that's a lot of movement. If you want like a specific submission from north-south, I mean, there's the, whatever paper that, cut, paper, cut, keyboard, paper cutter. Yeah, people can yeah, north -south north -south north -south yeah, north south choke. North south choke. Which is, some people can do that really good. <laughs> yeah. Another one kind of, kind of funny is, but it's true if you're heavier. Uh, if you go to Neon's stomach, they're going to react to that for sure. Like, you know, if you're light, they might be like, uh, whatever. But if you're over 200 pounds, they're definitely not going to like the knee and their solar plexus. They're going to move. So that's a way to make them react. You know? I just move, control the other collar, and I move it to his side and drop on the floor. A uh, couple details I like to do here: uh, when I pull the, the when I pull the shoulder up, I'm not only pressing uh, Jean's neck down, but I like to open my elbow to slow, and that helps. I do believe it helps with the pressure. And sometimes, if you don't get the grip here too tight. Uh, you still can do it just by just by pushing the elbow, just by applying that. Another way that I like to take this paper cutter, it's from here. When I'm in this position, the side control. So I'm here with my opponent, go this way. So what I do, I slide my hand back, I look for his head, then I slide down, I grab it right here his grip. Uh, it's the same thing as moving to the north-south. Because after a while they know the north south is coming, they start to block my hand. So here he has no idea what's gonna come. So what I do from here, just move back, I start to move on the floor, then I stop on the north south a little bit in between, then they can go from the floor. Then we move right there. And I just go to the side. So it's pretty much here. Yes, Like his whole body is stuck here, 
and it can take a tiny here to, to move for. So I, I like this grip a lot actually. And even if you start to the side to control, I think it's a very strong grip. Is that good? Yeah, it's awesome.